Discount codes are a great way to grow your customer base, make more revenue, and even track some promotional activities you're running on social media. In this video, I'm going to walk through three ways to automatically apply discount codes at Paid Memberships Pro Checkout. We'll show you how to do it with the default Paid Memberships Pro plugin, our site-wide sales companion plugin to run flash sales like Black Friday or Cyber Monday sales, and lastly, with a simple code recipe you can drop into your site that only needs one little line of customization. I know you can do it. Having customers miss adding a discount can create a lot of admin work. They're going to email you and say, oh, I saw the coupon, but I forgot to enter it on the checkout page. And you have to give them a partial refund, and it's a little bit annoying. Other things people can do with automatic discount codes, they can send out a direct link to the checkout page with the discount code automatically in the URL. So that helps people not miss the discount, but also see that they're getting a promotion uh, during the checkout process. So let's dive into these three methods. The first one I wanna show you is the default Paid Memberships Pro way to have a discount code in your URL. So I'm here in my membership site. I'm gonna navigate to Memberships Settings, and we're just gonna create a new discount code. So let's add one for this demo, we'll call it demo. Um, we'll make it active for the next year, that's fine. And then we're gonna set it for the beginner level. Let's make the beginner level $5 uh, and the recurring amount uh, 15, we'll say. And save code, cool. So now we have our demo code created. If you click here where it's applied to that level beginner, if you just click there, you'll get the URL you want, which is the URL of your site, membership account, membership checkout, the level ID and the discount code. So just appending discount code to the end of the URL with the code name uh, present will automatically apply it. You'll see here, the demo code has been applied to your order. The price for membership is five now and then $15. So that's a really quick way to automatically apply discount code. People can change the code if they had a different code they wanted to add, but you could copy and paste this link into any email that you wanted to send to people uh, and they wouldn't even have to check out your level page click through and choose a level or apply a discount code. So that's method one in the URL. The next method is site-wide sales. This is a companion plugin we made for membership sites, compatible with WooCommerce, easy digital downloads, and paid memberships pro. But I'm gonna show a very simple way to have an automatic discount run for a fixed period of time from a start to end date for your membership site. So this is particularly timely if you're thinking of setting up a sale for a Black Friday, but you just I just installed and activated the plugin and I'm going to create my first sale. So we're just gonna call this the demo discount code video sale. That name is not shown uh, to anyone on the site. So let's have it start like for the week that we're in right now, let's say, that would be good. Okay, cool, I set that. It's a paid memberships pro sale. We're gonna automatically apply the discount always and we'll use that demo coupon that we had. And that's really all we have to do to set it up. I won't put a banner on the site and I'll say that it's running. Cool, so let's click through to the front of the site and we'll see what happens when we have this sale active. So if we view our membership levels and let's say we click the professional plan. Uh, now when we go to checkout, it automatically applies the demo code. Uh, and I had set that up so that it worked on the professional plan, a 50% discount for the first membership period. You'll see that URL does not have the discount code in. This is all the site-wide sales plugin that's running this. And it'll automatically shut itself off. Uh, we can do the same thing for the uh, enhanced level, let's say, um, for this one. I already have this level. That won't work. Uh, we'd have to jump to a different way to get to the checkout page. But yeah, that's site -wide sales. Um, it was that easy, easy to set up. We didn't add a banner, which you could do, or a landing page. But basically, you set up a fixed period of time, choose a discount code, and set the rules to automatically apply at checkout. There's a lot of other rules, so we'll put a link in the description for all the other things site -wide sales can do. So I'm going to disable this, then we'll show you the third method for doing things. So let's just disable the site-wide sales plugin. Okay, so now if we go back to the site, you'll see if we do compare plans, click through the professional, it's not gonna automatically apply a discount code anymore. So the final way is a code recipe. Uh, it's here in our, our snippets library. I'm just gonna copy all of this code out uh, there. And I like to use this plugin called Code Snippets. Um, you can get it off of wordpress.org, it's free. So if you go snippets, add new, and I'll just copy that code block. This will be the automatic discount code blockout recipe, cool. Um, and then there's only one line of code you have to uh, customize here. It's this value for the code. Um, so we'll make it our demo, since that's what we've been using throughout. So what this does is behind the scenes, when 
people land on a page that has that level attribute in it, it will automatically apply that discount code if, if you don't otherwise see a discount code in the URL. So let's see how this works. Or on our levels page, I'm gonna click through to the professional. You'll see again, there's no discount code in the URL, but if I scroll through, again, that demo code is automatically applied, just like site-wide sales. So you could use that code approach if you uh, wanted to always have a discount on for the site, and always show that there's a coupon available to sites. Uh, you can make it apply to certain levels. So if we did for the demo site that it didn't apply to the level, it wouldn't apply because it couldn't apply the discount code. So those are the three methods. You can put the discount code in the URL with Base Paid Memberships Pro, send that link out on social media, send it in a newsletter, send it via a personal email to somebody. Uh, that's a great way to show people like, oh, here's a discount code and here's an easy link. Just click it. Sitewide sales, if you're running a flash sale on your membership site that has a start and end date and you want to run it like a promotion. And you could also add on those things like a sale banner across the top of your site or a custom landing page. And the third method is the code one. Easy drop in code. One place you have to customize it so it's not too complicated. Um, and the people like that code one. Um, it's just a good way so uh, people aren't always passing discount codes around. You could use CSS to hide some of these things on the site so people wouldn't really even know the discount code was being applied. So lots of ways to get creative. Reach out to us, post a comment on this video if you have questions about how these discount code recipes and tutorials work. We have another post on our site with lots of discount code customizations. We'll also link to that in the description below. I'm Kim Coleman. Thank you so much. Give this video a like if it was helpful to you.